Is a seven-year-old girl a pawn in the fight over a waste transfer station? The facility is under construction at 91st Street in the East River and could impact thousands of families. CBS 2's Weijia Jiang reports this commercial fuels an already fiery debate. It's not every day you see elderly grandmothers arrested, handcuffed, and hauled off to jail. In the hot debate over the waste transfer station being built on the Upper East Side, it seems anything goes to fight this politically charged project, the latest weapon to try to block it. We deserve better. We deserve better from our city. Seven-year-old Nisi Chumukama Flynn. That field is where 34,000 kids from around the city play. The star of a new TV commercial. The second grader is articulate, voicing her concerns. Trucks driving where kids play is just dangerous. We wanted to find out who little Nisi is and how she was chosen for the ad. Single mom Jillian Flynn adopted Nisi from Uganda two years ago. They live four blocks from the construction site. Right over here is where garbage trucks will pass through. Why do you think it would be scary to be around all those big trucks? Fair enough, shy and nervous, like any seven-year-old, but also paying attention to mom, who is off camera, prompting her. Don't look at your mom. You can look it right at me. <laughs> A representative for Asphalt Green told me Nisi's lines in the ad were scripted, and she had to audition for the unpaid role, but insists Nisi was selected based only on her personal ties to this area. Not everybody believes that. To be perfectly honest, I was disgusted when I saw that ad. City Councilman Antonio Reynoso says the commercial is misleading. For them, the image of uh, affluent, you know, white property owners or real estate interests is not an attractive uh, image so for anyone uh, in the city of New York. But a young uh, black girl to be able to make to send the message, I think, is what they're trying to use. Reynoso says Nisi is being used as a pawn to keep a trash facility out of one of the richest neighborhoods in town. This is all about them. It's very self-interested, and it's nimbyism at its worst. The president of the privately funded coalition behind the ad says... She is just a little girl in a real face, a real face of one of the children who's going to have harm. If you could talk to the mayor, and he was like, but I think it's a good idea to build it here, and, and you were right next to the mayor, what would you want to tell him? I would bring him to camp, and I would show him what it would be like with all the trucks coming in. This time, unscripted and unrehearsed. On the Upper East Side, Weijia Jiang, CBS 2 News. The city sanitation commissioner says there are several plans in place to mitigate the impact for people who live close by.